when my daughter turned 20, I wrote her a cookbook with uh, all the recipes that I used to uh, make for her and, and for my children and husband. And uh, they were very simplified recipes. And there were maybe about 60 or 70 recipes. She loved it and she used it all the time. After that, my husband said to me, why don't you write a cookbook? And I said, well, look, I'm not a professional chef. I don't know why I should. And he said, well, they're very simple recipes. Everybody understands them. Why don't you do it? And so I thought, all right, I will write something, but with a difference. I think what is interesting is to tell the story behind the food. So I started to think about it. And um, this is how Under the Olive Tree came to be. I told the story why I am writing about uh, this cookbook, the story about the influence of my grandfather who was a very famous chef, the places that influenced me and one thing led to another and this is how the first book came to be.